Yeah, definitely. Um, him and Zach Clark are, are a very good ruck combo, and um, it's always a big test going up against the, the biggest bloke in the AFL. You see, I'd probably say Aaron because of his uh, his size. He, um, I think he's got maybe about 12 centimetres and, and 15 kilos. So for me to uh, move him, it's a, a pretty pretty tough thing to do, but look, really looking forward to the challenge. Yeah, well, I don't want to give too much away, but uh, yeah, no, I think I'll, um, I'll definitely be, be trying to work him around the ground and, and make him chase me a fair bit. Um, I think I've probably got a little bit better tank than he does. So I might be finally starting to find some form after the weekend's game and a couple of weeks prior, minus the... Uh, yeah, the Hawthorne game where I went missing, but um, yeah, I'm obviously feeling really good about this week and body's feeling feeling fresh, so um, it's always good to go into a game feeling good. Yeah, obviously um, 100 games, it's probably not really a big milestone, but it's it's nice to, to tick it off and hopefully I can uh, notch up a few more throughout the years. Um, yeah, well definitely. Um, the way we, we sort of played on the weekend once Kurt went down, um, I, don't, I think I only come off the ground for about a, a minute of the game, so I definitely think I'll be spending a bit, bit of time forward as, as well as in the ruck, because uh, it's a pretty tough gig, and I doubt I'd be able to spend the, the whole game running around in the ruck. Yeah, definitely. Um, anything can happen in a, a prelim. It's a, a big game, and it doesn't matter whether you've had the weekend off or, or you've played a hard game of footy. You're, uh, you're going to be doing everything you can to get yourself right and get yourself up for that game, and I'm sure we'll all be going in at uh, 100% and giving it our all. You've just got to get yourself up for these big games, and... It's really not a, not a hard thing to do when you're playing in a prelim final to uh, get the berth in the grand final. So I don't, I don't think there's uh, yeah, it's going to help us at all being done it done it before. But um, obviously yeah, it's a massive challenge for us, and um, they are a great side. So it's going to take our best to get into the granny. Oh, it's a, it's a big game of footy, so there's uh, there's a lot of pressure on both of us. Um, obviously we we've, we've probably taken the uh, the underdog card again as well now, but um, that's something that we've we've always enjoyed and and uh, always will, I guess, because it's always good to pr prove people wrong and, and to uh, yeah, get the win. Pretty much all, all, the, all the players get an exit row seat, um, except for your blokes like Benny McGlynn and that that are tiny <laughs> and they can't, they can't reach the floor when they're sitting on the seat anyway. So <laughs> yeah, you, you can put blokes like that anywhere, him and, him and Kieran Jack. He was uh, probably almost unlucky not to make All-Australian. Uh, his first half of the year was, was sensational and um, I think the partnership we've formed now is... He's probably one of the one of the tougher ones in the league. So, um, but credit to him, the way he's he goes about his footy and and he's always in there looking at ways to improve and and doing everything. So it's not no real shock that he's he's taken the leaps and bounds forward that he has.